All right, thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm gonna do my wet, dry, wet setup and how I've done this. So I run four cable method with the head, with the 5150. The effects then comes out into the effects return of the helix. And once it does, it goes through a noise gate. It's the only thing I have post, and then it separates. So one side goes back through the output of the helix into the effects return of the head. So the only thing that is really in the effects loop of the head is the gate. Then the other two go to an, I have an IR now. Eventually I'm gonna program the IRs in there, which I'm using uh, Marshall cabinet with, uh, with the EVH speakers, the uh, Celestian speakers. That's what the IR is with, I think it's the modern miking technique. Um, and then it goes into a stereo delay. There's a couple of the delays, but stereo delay, stereo reverb. So right now all you're gonna hear is the stereo plate reverb on the sides, but right down the middle is just dry guitar. That's not, Eddie didn't really use reverb live, but I think it sounds good. So let's see how it sounds. <laughs> Sounds pretty, pretty huge. Now the delay, it says delay 420, but I have it set to kind of what he did uh, live, which is 398 one side and 800 the other side. So it gives you kind of a ping pong effect. And I know those aren't the exact values, but I think he did it because there was like a, because in those old, uh, in those old units, I think there's enough, there's like maybe a four millisecond or so delay of it even getting the delay out. So it kind of, it kind of like evens out the delays. I know there was something weird about the old um, harmonizers with that when they did with the way that the digital conversion or whatever did it, that there was a, a delay in just doing the effect. So I don't know if it's the same with this or not, but it sounds good. So. <laughs> On the delays of course you're hearing the delays but there is dry signal in there too it's it's like it i think it's at like 30 or and 40 percent mix or something like that based on the delays because one's short one's longer um and the feedbacks are a little bit different but anyway that's what part of what makes it big there's other things i'm thinking about doing like adding a little bit of harmonization on both sides so as long as they still have some dry down the middle adding like you know i think it was like minus nine and plus nine or minus eight and plus eight but also if you add a little delay into that dry signal and that's a hundred percent mixed or a hundred percent wet on those two it really like widens it up and that's kind of what a like a mimic pedal does or whatever so <laughs>
anyway, with my Wolfgang USA, brand new, maybe three or four months old. Sweet. Thanks, everybody.